For all the people who judge without knowing Just throw the peace, I tell them good vibes only, yeah They were hating, but we didn't even notice cause Hi guys, welcome to Wake Up World Enlightenment Now My name is Eric Tavares And I am Duchess Carroll And today's topic, we are focusing on the five elements of, I guess Spirit. spirit. Well, that is the fifth element. That is but, the fifth element. So we're doing the four I'm elements. Top down. Right? Yeah. From the top tops down? Yeah. Okay. All right. I got spirit, it. Spirit, water, <laughs> fire, earth, and air. I like to do earth, air, fire, water, and spirit. spirit. Yeah. Spirit fingers, y'all. Yes. Get your spirit <laughs> fingers. Let me see. Ooh. Mm, spirit fist, yes. too. Yes. Spirit <laughs> fist. <laughs> That's another podcast as well. Um, yes. <laughs> I'm loving my fro. Do you like the fro? Yeah, my hair looks really flat compared to your fro. It's a wig. I got it at Party City. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I have no party. <laughs> Just party kidding. Looks. Anywho, so we're doing earth, air, fire, water, and spirit. Um, I'm an air sign. I'm an air sign. Yeah, I find Yes. It's about Chi Chi's. Oh, Heart yes. chakras. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and we're gonna bump uglies later too. Honey. You never know. You never know with us. Oh my gosh. Yes. Anywho, well, I'm an air sign. Yes. You're an air sign. Yeah. And then I think my roommate's uh she's a fire sign. And most people go off their zodiac signs to find what they are. That's how people find out what they are. Um, but it's good to explore other other uh well, i love exploring like yeah exploring. Get my backpack but you can explore other elements because we were just talking beforehand and like i definitely connect to water even though i'm an air sign i'm definitely an air sign but i connect to water i definitely I love being near the water i connect to vodka that's a sign potatoes that's <laughs> earth potatoes are earth See, right? i told so you yeah. i was saying i was i'm an earth sign you know? yeah. i'm definitely yeah. into potatoes <laughs> 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 potatoes, oh potatoes, whatever you want to call it. It's like it all goes in the dirt. Right? Let me <laughs> see. Okay, so it says uh, four basic elements are either masculine or feminine. Mm -hmm. So, um, well, I don't even really know. Does that mean earth, air, fire, and water are can either be masculine and feminine or they're one or the other? One, they usually, um, like with water, if you're a water sign, then the gender is usually feminine and passive. Oh, okay. Just kind of goes with the flow, you know. So each one has their own little um, Sign. quality that okay. they have. Yeah. I think I'm both then because so, I can be masculine when yeah. I need to be, like in the bedroom or at work <laughs> or in the bedroom. And then I can be feminine. In the bedroom. Well, you know, air, air, is, air is a masculine sign, so, you know, it's... Whew! Yeah. Strong is... And, like, that's so masculine because it's pink. It's as yeah. strong as beautiful, honey. I'm so masculine. Real men can wear pink. You I, know this. I, I do. I do. I do. I do. Let's see. Well, it says each of the four basic elements are either masculine or feminine. Masculine energy is noted to be uh, with the sun. Mm -hmm. So energetic, bright, warm, and aggressive people. And so yeah. I think that we're obviously... I'm definitely sun. I'm yeah. sun too. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm definitely more connected with sun anyway. I like before being, I even knew all that. I like being in the sun regardless. I just, yeah. I don't like Sun is like cold. food to me. It's like, I have to have it. Yeah. I have to be out there. Yep. I wish the sun was up right now. I know. <sighs> <sighs> we're both like... <laughs> we're in Texas with no sun. We don't know how to it's act. It's March and it's supposed to snow. Like, we'll see it. This is how I know the poles are shifting. Like, this is crazy. Yep. Like, we're three months behind winter, and it's really, they're trying to forecast snow in March. I'm like, you're, yeah. you've got to be kidding and me. If, and like a week ago, it was like almost 80. Yes, and and I was outside both days. I was like, ah. Oh, and then I woke up, days. and there was ice on my car, and I'm like, what the is going on? Seriously. <laughs> Y'all have got to figure it out, elements. <laughs> yeah. Something that you can do with elements, this is just something that I'm learning, is you can actually communicate with them, which we already know. Like So mm -hmm. like, fire has to do with salamanders, and earth has to do with gnomes, and air has to do with sylphs, and water has to do with... I don't know what water has to do with. Yeah. For me, uh, when I play undines. with air, I play with just energy and the air. And if, you, if you've played with things like uh well i've told you about psi wheels before they're little yes. things you can make move look it up on youtube it's psi wheel psi honey yes 
But if you learn how to use that energy, then you can take it outside and play with the air around you and you can use your energy. In fact, my hands are vibrating right now thinking about it, cool. but you can make a, the wind pick up and like, you know, it takes... That's where I'm, I'm, I'm definitely um, learning that I am powerful with wind and I'm powerful with sylphs. Mm -hmm. And I do all my stuff with... Especially after Mexican food. Oh, We're all yeah. powerful <laughs> wind. And broccoli. <laughs> broccoli makes me a very powerful wind person, honey. Just, woo. <laughs> for real, for real. We're going to move on to um, feminine energy and stuff like with the moon. So people yes. that are like cool, dark, very passive, receptive. Are you saying all the cool people are moon people? No, cool. Because I'm not... Oh. Like cool colors. Oh, oh no. no. The old yeah. cool people are sun signs. Everyone knows that. Oh. Come on. <laughs> if you're not a sun sign, I'm so sorry. You're not honorarily sorry. cool. <laughs> you're still cool. Yes. You're just not you're cool. as cool. I'm just kidding. You're really cool. <laughs> I know I'm being so mean right now. Stop <laughs> it. <laughs> I love everybody, even if you're a moon sign. I just don't like Scorpios. <laughs> I got lots of problems going on today. <laughs> <laughs> I do, I do. Let's see. Um, water. So it says water is an emotional sign. Um, mm -hmm. It's an element that has fluid emotions. It's ever changing. It's always moving like a river. People that are a water sign are really intuitive. They're sensitive and they're compassionate. And those with this sign have trouble becoming the people or the environment. Oh, wait. They have trouble with becoming the people or the environment they surround themselves with. I guess they're like... It says they go with the flow, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm not a water sign. I can resonate with some of that, though. Like, cause I, I can feel... resonate with some of it. I'm, you know, definitely, I can go with the flow. But... No, I can definitely go with the flow, too. Yeah. It says that the strengths of a water sign, though, are understanding, trusting, being devoted, forgiving, and flexible. That I can definitely resonate with. I can resonate with all but the trust. Trust has to be, for me, earned. Um, I've had people say that trust should just always be there, and I'm like, not if you lived my See, life. That's, that's where I'm at. I, <laughs> I have trust issues, but now I'm just at the point where I'll give everyone the benefit of the doubt. And then the first time, I'm, I don't even do a second benefit of the doubt. I kind of put I give trust you the from doubt. a distance. Like, I will be like, yeah, we'll let them hang themselves with the trust if they want. Like, right. I mean, I won't push someone completely away, but I'll let them, you know hang themselves with I like the how trust. you do that with a rope because I'm like, okay, I guess I do. Like, say, here, go. Yeah. And then if they do hang themselves, I just cut it. Yep. We're done. Exactly. And yeah. I That's kind of how I do. And I'm like, I don't have time for this. Yeah. But uh, nope. Yeah. I'm like, I wasn't doing you like that, so you shouldn't do me like that. Yeah. Um, people with the water sign, it says your weaknesses are you're unstable, you're prone to depression, you're irrational, you're gullible, and you have a lack of self-esteem. I definitely have the gullible down. Yeah. It could be because I'm a bleach blonde. <laughs> I mean, it, ha it might be seeping into that, that head of yours, honey. It may be seeping up into there, girl. Is this natural? Uh, I don't. There's nothing to test it on, so we will never Let's know. Find out. Not even my eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> Not even my eyebrows. I highlight in those. We're gonna find out. <laughs> there's we'll nothing. Go, we're gonna go on her other website, and we'll find out. You can go see Carol on her other website. I accept PayPal. <laughs> <laughs> she's on Vimeo, and she's also on uh, what is that? Uh, Fansonly.com, yeah. yeah. She has XNXX, her, is that X, one? Oh, is that is the that one, one you use? No, oh, sometimes. Okay. I'm on Pornhub, and I'm also on X, too, but <laughs> you can't see my face, but you can recognize my tattoo, so that's all I'll say. Have fun. Is that what you named it, tattoo? <laughs> I have a tattoo. I want to a fantasy island, and here is tattoo. Oh, no. I'm talking about my actual tattoo. <laughs> I love your tattoo. <laughs> So As for whenever I used to drink and get wasted, I would say, which one do you want to be? <laughs> but now I'm just like, I can do both. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm horrible. You should put like a star and put you are here. And that way they'll know what they're going to be. This is exactly where you are in the universe. You're right here on all fours. <laughs> I love my tattoo. <laughs> it was free. <laughs> oh, it's cute. Love it. <laughs> Moving on. Okay. We're going to go with fire. Ooh, yes. Hot. Fire is forceful. That can be me um, at times. Those born under this sign are uh, very passionate and warm. They light up any environment they enter. Fire people are natural born leaders, and those with this sign do run the risk of burning out 
if too focused or passionate about one thing. So like people with the fire I, sign. Yeah, I tune into fire occasionally. So I guess I do dabble in some well, I others. Because we're all, you were saying, we are all part of we're earth, air, fire, all water. all elements, yeah. It depends on what you truly connect with. And of course, a lot of people do the zodiac, so which makes us air, you and me, so. I'm all I got. Yeah. I can resonate with all we're of them. airheads. <laughs> she is, because she's the blonde. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. We can test mine out. <laughs> What's crazy though is the symbol or the elemental for this is a salamander. And so um, a mythical fire lizard. And whenever I was going through my awakening um, and I was reading about reptilians and my ex-boyfriend used to always call me his pregnant lizard. And then people were like, you have the body of a Geico. And then that's a salamander. And mm -hmm. So I can resonate with a lot of uh, being fire or the elemental fire as well. And I have incorporated it into my... Um, rituals and my meditation moments and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And so like I'm very forceful at times, um, especially in the bedroom. Oh. Carol can tell you about that. <laughs> Which time? <laughs> <laughs> Say! <laughs> Unless she has tequila and then, then it's fine. <laughs> right, because tequila, tequila just brings the fire out of me, honey. Um, but no, I definitely resonate with a lot of fire signs are other strengths is being passionate, being, being very bright, charismatic, being focused, being decisive, yeah. being daring. And I'm a daredevil. I will try anything once. This might kill you. I'll still try it. <laughs> it doesn't scare me. I'm not afraid of dying. So I'm like, uh, there's lots of things that I still want to go do. I want to go skydiving. I want to go jump off. I want to do We need throws. to do iFly. It's iFly. You don't know what iFly is? It's when you can... Um Skydive indoors. Oh, that's indoor skydive. In we need to do that for a podcast. Ooh. As long as I get to dress up like the Pink Rangers, I'm okay. I have to we'll be, have to see. Right? That, yeah, that would be really, we'd be like, okay, we're air signs. We can do this. And yep. then, whap! <laughs> I can just imagine. <laughs> <laughs> and then that you'll get to see fun. Carol P herself. That would be a fun. Oh, <laughs> she's in a water sports job. <laughs> she's making it rain. Just Golden shower, rest. honey. Just Going back. Wait, go <laughs> She's gonna give a whole new meaning to that. <laughs> Weaknesses for people that are under the fire sign. Um, oh, we forgot to tell you. Well, I guess if you don't know what sign you are, y'all can look that up on your own. And we'll put a we'll put a picture up there of you know the different months and okay. who's what and all that. I don't so feel like yeah. reading or telling people all that. You should know what your yeah. sign is. Yeah. Actually, you probably don't know what your sign is because I didn't learn that I was an air. For your sign element until, sign, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what my element. Because my sign is Libra, Mom, balanced. Aquarius. But I didn't know that I was an air sign until this last year. So 35 years of my life, and I didn't even know that there was earth, air, fire symbols. I knew of them, but I didn't know that I was one of them. Yeah. Or all of them. Yeah. Technically. Um, weaknesses of people under the fire sign are that they're prone to anger and rage. I think this is my mother. <laughs> They can be obsessive. That could be my ex. They're unfaithful. That's also my ex. They can be jealous. That's also my <laughs> ex. Easily irritated. That's me. <laughs> and vindictive. That's a lot of people in my past. <laughs> I must have been hanging out with a lot of fire people in my past. That's what. I, now that I'm looking at this, I'm like, dang. I'm, I'm glad that I have uh, got away from these people because I'm not. But people are brought into your life so that you'll notice learn. that and see what you resonate with and what you don't and what you don't want to be like for me i was you know it's, someone said this uh, yesterday at the meeting uh it helps them every human encounter helps them identify the character defect within themselves yes, like what do absolutely. i not like about that person okay. and then do you that, say, see that in myself yeah and then you're like, and if oh, so that's how can me. i change it yeah, yeah. exactly it's crazy exactly next sign is earth i'll let you read this one. Oh, people under the earth sign are reliable practical and logical these people are wary of bringing others into their inner circle. Maybe I'm part earth because I'm kind of that way. Yeah. I seem I mean, really you, friendly, you but do. I do have like a She has a thing circle. with like when people are friending you, you already told me, you, know, yeah. you better have a lot in common. So. Yeah, yeah. But I'm very wary about that too. Yeah. Uh, but they'll be fiercely loyal to those that they do accept into their inner circle. Earth sign people do tend to be homebodies and solid to a fault. They're, uh, we'll put the symbols up because we'll put the, picture of everything and what they mean right. uh, throughout this video. Uh, but it is a feminine sign, a feminine element. And I was just telling and her before this too that I think I'm air yeah. and earth. Yeah. And right now I'm a homebody. Isn't that weird? Because I don't, I used to be like out partying all the time and now I stay at home for fun. Yeah. It's, it's so yeah, I think that we, as we become more spiritual, we kind of connect a lot more with all the elements. Because I'm definitely more homebody and, you know, 
back in the party and like okay, that never happened. So oh, well, I selectively party. She wants someone to go party with her because yeah. I can't take Good her party. now because I'm I'm in recovery. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know how to party. They'll do anything for a vodka. Uh, I'm just gonna they're gonna be I'm gonna be living in the rehab facility. Like Eric, what do you got? We did this project when I was in elementary and you took potatoes and you stuck toothpicks in them and you uh -huh. put them in a jar of water and they grew. Yeah. So I'm going to do that and make homemade vodka in my room. Really? I thought <laughs> about carving out it. I could just carve out a potato and carve it all completely out, fill it with vodka, put the little potato lid back on it and a straw and then bring, I can bring it up to your work. Nobody would know. Just say it's Wait, potato, potato juice. <laughs> it's potato juice. Organic. Organic <laughs> potato juice. Yes. Where's it from? Sverka. Oh. <laughs> it's from the ground. Yeah, duh, duh come on. <laughs> mm, that's smart. I'm going to look into potato juice after this. I really <laughs> am. Juice. I could be like, what are you doing at uh, the grocery store? <laughs> I'm buying potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the strengths of the earth, <clears throat> of the earth element people, and non people, because okay. we're all not always people. Earth anythings. Okay, they're stable and consistent. They're hardworking, loyal, nurturing, logical, and empathetic. The weaknesses of them are lazy, scornful, overly cautious, <laughs> stubborn, and rigid. <laughs> My weakness is being lazy. Yeah. Well, for me, I, I I'm more like indecisive. I want to do things and it's not that I'm lazy. It's just like, I don't know what to do. I have so many things I want to do. I can't even decide on what I want to do. Pick one and I then know. let it open the doors to the rest. Yeah. That's, that's what, what everyone keeps telling me. Like, I know how many ways I want to help change the world. Got to start somewhere. I know. This. Yeah. We and I'm at that pivotal moment in my life that I have to make that choice right now. Ah, it's so. everyone knows we're at a really big pivotal moment today because it is March 3rd, 2019, which adds up to 333. Yeah, lots of changes coming up. The past is the past. New, the next next mm -hmm. three months are going to be amazing. So yes, I can't wait to see what's going to happen. Yeah. Happy, happy three three three, everyone. Happy three three three. Yeah. <laughs> the last one we're going to talk about is our air sign because we're both air signs. Air mm -hmm. is constantly in motion. That's me. I can't seem to sit still. I can't seem to stop talking. I can't seem to stop dancing. Mm -hmm. um, those born under this sign have a mind that is ever thinking. Yes. Um, they excel at multitasking. That is. <laughs> So true, and we get very distracted very easily. Oh my God! What? Hmm? Oh, what is out there? <laughs> Look at that! Oh, there's some birds. <laughs> Obviously, you can tell that we're air signs because we can never stay on topic. Um, yeah. Yeah, you should we, see that what we have to put on the editing floor, like the you know uh, yeah, the cut parts. It's of crazy. All these videos. We just go. <laughs> Why do you have to make us like that? It's like almost all air signs are ADD, ADHD. I think it's because our our brains, because it's not like. Uh, like it seems like Earth would be very grounded people, and we're just more like we can do. We're my head, flighty. My we're head, just my like head's we always in the clouds. And, That's what we're saying. Yeah. Like. And so your brain thinks so quick that it gets off topic. Like I mean, that's the way I, I my brain is working constantly and and thinking thinking. It's not that it's overthinking. It's just it thinks so much that you can't even about tons of different things. Yeah. I don't even know. But, I mean, I do, I'll, I'll, I do that all the time too. I'll be yeah. reading and I'll be here and then I'm there. And then my room is, what are you doing? I'm like, I can't find this on my phone. And I'm just like, <laughs> well, <laughs> how many people are in my head right now? Why am I thinking about so many different topics? That's why I'm like, I have to yeah. meditate or yeah. medicate. For me, it's grounding. I have to stay grounded. I am horrible at not being grounded, but I like being... You're grounded. <laughs> My parents You've should have grounded me bad, more. You've been a bad, bad girl. I saw you on XX and X. You're grounded. <laughs> For real, you can see it on XX and X. <laughs> Maybe after this week. <laughs> I'm not going to go there. Maybe. We'll talk about that later. Uh -huh, yeah. Later. Anywho, people with the air sign is a triangle pointed up. Come on, Illuminati. Um, <laughs> love it, right? The gender is masculine. What? I'm mm -hmm. masculine? This mm. is all mas. Oh, I guess the beard is masculine. Yeah, my beard. I shaved mine, so. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I would have been blonde anyways. <laughs> yeah, it would have been. You wouldn't be able to see it. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> and it says that, well, the elementals on this is sylphs, and that's something that I'm like truly passionate about, and it's something that I work with every single day. Which is spirit of the air. Yes. That's sylph. And it's crazy because sylphs are controlled by their supervisor is called a diva. And that's my drag name, honey. My name oh. is Diva. And it was Diva Divine. 
So I'm only that I am a divine. Isn't there's like goddess. isn't it like D E V A H uh-huh. or something like that? Yeah. And how crazy is that the person that gave me my drag name, I didn't choose my name as a diva. Uh, the person that did, her name was Champagne, and she was into black magic or the the occult. Oh, so, so she, it's like yeah, it's, it's, it's like she kind of sure. I think someone told her name him diva. Yeah. Uh, so he'll figure out who he is later in life. Yeah. And now I'm figuring out that who I am. And so I'll see a Kim Cho and I'll invoke the sylphs and I call the watchtowers of the east and I and I'll be like watching the skies just change and air move and I'm like I really do have a gift that I'm learning how to work with and I'm yep. super excited. I can't wait to figure out what other gifts I can do with earth, air, and fire. Yes. But right now I'm really just focused on working with air because I find I, I have learned that I do have a really good power with working and with you know them. if you wanted to do a simple little experiment with fire and air at the same time and you can light a candle you know and you know you can either think it or put your hand near it right. and you'll see the fire you know take off it'll get bigger it'll grow it'll do things that normal candles aren't doing right normal candles just kind of flicker and sway a little so yeah you can kind of play around with the energies there it says that our favorite season of the year is spring. Yes. I can agree with that. Spring and summer for me. I love, I love the heat and I love the sun. Mm-hmm. Absolutely. And our thoughts. When life our, comes our, back. <laughs> our strengths are being thoughtful. We're witty. We're charming. We're carefree. We're independent and we're flexible. I yes. am. You can I'm see, very flexible. I am too. You can see that flexibility <laughs> on XXNX as well. <laughs> you can see mine on Pornhub. <laughs> <laughs> I've been tied up so many different ways, girl. <laughs> I'm super flexible, though. And I just loaded a video of me doing the split. Like, people would never guess I was in my, at that age. My yeah. weaknesses, it says my weaknesses that I'm very inconsistent. I guess I can, I can see. I don't know. Pretty much any time we set a time that we're going to do. Oh, like, yeah. <laughs> that we're going to do the it's podcast funny that you're a going there time, too. That we always <laughs> hit the mark. Always. And we both do. We yeah, really are. Yeah. We're and then, very, well, it's very like consistent this too. about I'm being supposed, inconsistent. I'm supposed, to be at, I'm supposed to be at work at a certain time. And then the more that I research on air signs, it says that we do not um, apply the concept of time to us in the material realm. That, that to us, we, we move at whatever. We move when we want to move. And I'm not moving a second before or a second after. And I really don't care if I show up on time or not. I will that get there totally when me. I get there. That we're like, sure. That's totally me. We're <laughs> insensitive. Um yep. What insensitive? Oh, that's a weakness. I'm insensitive to stupidity. Yeah, I can't send. I can't send stupidity at all. Or no, 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 no. I'm insensitive to brainwashing, and yeah. I'm insensitive. Yeah. It's hard. Like, uh, yeah. But there's this one great meme that's like, it's the lion with wings coming down, talking to the lion, and the lion's like, they're all so stupid, and he's like, you can't, you can't call them stupid and wake them up at the same time. And I'm like, but that's how I feel. Yeah. They're all dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being honest right I now. I am in the, I'm, a, I'm using my strength. I know strength. a lot of people agree with I'm, this I'm using this my one. strength of being carefree. I'm carefree with my words. I'm tired of trying to help these people that I don't get it. But yeah. I love it at the same time. Yeah. But sometimes I just get so fed up where I just like, yeah. I want to slap them. Like, what are you with the Well, fuck you know, here? once you've tried so much, it just makes it really hard. It's like, okay, come on. Come on. But I realized that I, I can't can force, I, I'm learning that I can't force their awakening on them. Mm-hmm. And they're, if they're not ready, they're not ready. Yeah. But at the same time, I'm like, but I really don't want to have to watch them, like, be taken or let go or die or something, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, I'm trying all my hardest and to, And it's like, really wait. hard to, like, you know, people are, are, they should awaken when they're supposed to awaken, but also if they ask for help and then you're trying to help them and then they're like, and then they don't want I to can't implement. hear you. And yeah. it's like, okay, well, then don't ask for help. Because that, that's really frustrating to me. It's yeah. like, don't ask me. You just wasted both of our time, you know? <laughs> it says that we can be very selfish at times. I think that was more in my past. But now that I'm actually awakened, I have become so less, so I'm more of giving to others and stuff. Mm-hmm. But things that do work my nerve <laughs> is like when you take from me without asking. And I'm like, yeah. And that's just something that has been going on in my past. But now it's this whole time yeah. now that we're like giving our notice to the apartments and stuff. Everything has just become so I'm like, because we're realizing that we don't have very much time left together. Like yeah. it's become, you can tell a complete difference. Um, weaknesses says that we can be flaky. I'm one of those that's like, y'all yeah, go. And then I won't. <laughs> No, he's never done that. <laughs> Not to her. I don't think I've ever done that to you. Wait, except for last weekend, you were supposed to, on the Saturday, we were going to do the... Oh, part. yeah, but we changed that to Sunday. Hey, I was, I was banged. He, he, he was partially flaky. I was bracked out, okay? 
I had taken three energy drinks. I was fucked up. But hey, I got my apartment cleaned. Yes, you did, and it looks awesome. I know, right? Yeah. I, I, this Y'all need to go to his wall and go tell him how nice his wall looks. His, his other it walls look, it look. really good. And then yesterday <laughs> I painted, but I had to. I had oh, to. Oh, I saw the painting. It's wonderful. Yeah, I'm gonna do. Awesome. I'm doing more tonight. And then the last one is the element of spirit, which yeah. we all. It's the fifth element. Yeah, so it's the fifth element. Go on about that. Yeah. Okay. The fifth element is spirit, and everyone has the element of spirit. Do I have the element of spirit? You're one of everyone. Oh, I am, huh? <laughs> you special snowflake, <laughs> you. I am a special snowflake. <laughs> spirit doesn't have a Let special group of people. Spirit is all. <laughs> <laughs> the element can be called other names, such as ether, aether. Is that how aether? you would say that? Aether? aether? Yeah. Yeah. Quintess- or quint- quintessence? Quintessence. Which means I like just saying the fifth element. I like that movie was one of my favorite things because fifth element, the movie, and then she had the four stones all up inside of her. I think I'm gonna go put some stones up inside of me tonight. I'm gonna put some earth, air, fire, water, and do me some Ben Wall balls, girl. Oh wow! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna get really grounded. I'm gonna, I'm gonna invoke all four spirits. Ah. <laughs> you can we need some to do that too. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting some thoughts up in her. I love it. Spirit has no standard shape. But circles and swirls are commonly used for spirit because it's just ever moving, you know? We're invoking something within you. Awaken. Come on. We're using our little magic Get with wands. The program. Yes. Ever We're fingering. She likes you. Fingering. <laughs> <laughs> I'm more of this. <laughs> Not guess, yet. I'm waiting until my 40th guess birthday. Guess it's better than. Yeah, I mean, like, you never, you never know. We never, ever, ever know. But yeah, I feel more most connected with air. Yeah. Second connected with earth for me. Mm-hmm. Think third would be water and last is fire. Yeah. I just don't work with fire because I, I'm ADD and I might start a fire. and then it's already But you ha- like candles, so you I can like definitely a- play around with that little bit of energy since you do have candles. Well, girl, I almost burnt the fireplace down again uh, this past week because I... Douse the firewood in lighter fluid. Okay, so it's not that the fire that was the problem. It was the, don't put lighter fluid on things. Well, yeah, I was, I was like, <laughs> but I went and had to go get the water of spirit. I had my jug all <laughs> freaking me out. I was scared, honey. I was scared. Oh, look at the birds. What you got out we there? We get bird, distracted. Bird food, bird feed. Bird feed, yeah. Oh. Yeah. I'm a pet bird. <laughs> Put some bird seed outside your window and you'll have pet birds. I throw rice every on day. I you throw rice. Ra- I'm just kidding. You throw <laughs> rice I don't think they can digest it from what I no, hear. No, that's what they die. That's how they kill birds. I used to do that oh. as a child. That's horrible, huh? They kill them. Oh. My mom would be like, go feed the birds. And I was outside throwing rice on the roof. Did not realize that we were killing animals. And the little animals are like, um, they know this is America, right? They keep throwing us cheeseburgers, not rice. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, what are you doing throwing us rice? We eat cheeseburgers and fries now. <laughs> yeah, really. Just think about it. It's crazy. I watch birds eat all kinds of crazy shit now. I'm just like. Well, they will, yeah. They, I mean, they eat what they can. So we decided to just, we, I love having the life right outside our window. We you just really put do. little it's really neat. plates of bird seed and I just love life. So mm-hmm. we're going to call this one to a close. Yes. Let us know if you're what your sign or what your symbol is, right? Or your element is. I'm air. She's air. Yep. Just let us know what you are, and we will talk to you next time. Bye. Bye. For all the people who judge without knowing, just. Throw the peace, I tell them good vibes only, yeah They were hating, but we didn't even notice Cause we're on it, them good vibes only, yeah The shit is wavy, like we're in the ocean Cause we're on it, them good vibes only, yeah For all the people who judge but don't know me I just throw the peace, I tell them good vibes